missile down, one, two, three, on approach to New Texas. This town is not being run properly, Mr. Mayor. Look at the marshal back there. He's sleeping on the job. Intolerable. <laughs> now, just a terrium picking minute, Mr. Ambassador. If it weren't for Marshal Bravestar, Tex Hex would make things plenty hot around here. Tex Hex can hardly be as dangerous as you claim, Mayor Derringer. Planetary marshals are needed where there is a real danger. <laughs> Mr. Ambassador! I'll have Marshal Bravestar removed as soon as I make my report to the Planetary Command. Uh, here comes the thistle down. Finally. <laughs> there she is. The biggest, most heavily armed carrium freighter in the galaxy. will be most lots carry him we ever got. <laughs> you weasel weasel, this ain't no stick up. This is the big time. If I get that bird beaked ambassador in my hands, the whole planetary union will have to do what I say. <laughs> you violence ready to ride. Mr. Ambassador, please reconsider. We need Brave Star. My mind is made up, Mayor. New Texas has no need of a planetary marshal. Now, I must get aboard the ship to recharge my air tank. My breathing atmosphere will run out soon. What's that? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh-oh, here comes trouble. So here I go. Activate the defenses, Fuzz. Tex Hex is coming. Um, uh, Mayor, what's going on here? Great galaxy! I've got to protect the ambassador! <laughs> uh, activating fortress mode is no. Full big partner. Ears of the wolf. The wolf. The wolf. Hog time. Dingoes, take care of Green Star. The rest of you, follow me. We're gonna get that ambassador. So that's their plan. We gotta stop. <laughs> Brain. I'll tie it in 
not. <coughs> I eat bacon for breakfast, pig nose. <laughs> Come on, big partner, back to town. Quit playing around. I never get to have any fun. Oh, well. Tex, they shut him hatch door. That's okay. We're gonna make our own door. Good. Last one. <gasps> Sandstorm! A little sleepy dust, please. Oh, sleepy. Uh, must sound alarm. Shurkins, this door is locked too. You got the key for understand? Sure, sure do. <laughs> Ten magnifums of carrium to whoever captures that goose head ambassador. <laughs> oh, no. Quick, ambassador. Well, we've got to keep you out of Tex Hex's clutches until. Until what? My breathing gas will run out in an hour. Until Bravestar can get us out of here. Bravestar. <laughs> I'd hate to have to count on him. Don't count on him. <laughs> Tex Hex will give us ten megatherms and carry them each for this haul. Bravestar! Tex Hex is up there with the ambassador and Derringer. Out of reach. We've got to get to that ship and stop Tex Hex before it's too late. It's already too late, Marshal. I have taken a thistle down. One, two, three. All orders to planetary command come from me. <laughs> as long as he's got the ambassador. Planetary Command will have to do what he says. I think we've got a problem. There's trouble, Shaman. I know. I saw Tex Hex capture the freighter and the Signian Ambassador. We've got to get on that freighter. Can your magic get me aboard, old friend? I will try. We did it! <laughs> <laughs> All right! You beat Brave Star this time, Master. <laughs> I sure did. Long as I got the ambassador, them varmints have to do whatever I say. <laughs> Still think Tex Hex is harmless, Ambassador? Brave Star! Mm, are you ready, Brave Star? I am. Then let it begin. Smoke feels funny like, sort of thick somehow, as though I could um, walk on it. And so you can always remember, belief can build bridges. Our thanks, Shaman. Come on, 3030, let's ride! <laughs> Carrium doesn't surrender. He's a gone bird. You hear me? Keep it quiet, Big Pard. 
He thinks we're still down in the town. Surrender, or the ambassador's gonna stop you beating! <laughs> that monster! JP, do you read me? Brave Star. Thank goodness. Where are you? I'm right above you. Throw me a line. We need your help. Coming right up, Marshal. Got it. Now, hang on! You hear me, Brave Star? <laughs> the alarm! It's the Marshal and that blasted judge sneaking aboard. Thunderstick! Viper! Sandstorm! Strength of the Bear! We have intruders! Get them! Mmm, oh boy. Playtime! <laughs> Better split up, partners. You two knock out the energy to the ship's weapons. And I'll take care of Hex. Oh, do. how is your breathing supply holding out? <laughs> Not much left. If your friend Bravestar doesn't find a way to get us out of here soon. Bravestar always finds a way. But look, Tex, Hex and his men have gone. We're alone. How is that going to help us? We can't move. Don't be so sure. Thunderstick was careless. He forgot to take away my stun pistol. It worked. Sure did. Now, now, let's get those chains off. We have got to find some atmosphere for you. <laughs> Sleepy dust. No, getting sleepy. <laughs> Looks like dream time for Judge Woman. Not quite. Dust, but I have to find the ship's energy supply and turn it off. Well, you're too weak, and, and I, I, I can't move. Looks like it's up to you, Mr. Ambassador. Uh, me? But I have to find my breath supply. On this planet, we all have got to help out when needed. Please, we came here to help you. Now we need your help. I'll do my best. That weapon should be right down here somewhere. Oh, now you done it. You hit me when I weren't looking. And that makes me mad! Almost out, but I must keep going. The energy room is just ahead. Tex Hex should be around here somewhere. Ah, there he is. What? It's Brave Star! Energy controls must be in here. <sighs> you 
you'll be sorry for that, brave star. Because now I'm going to destroy the town right in front of your eyes. No! Looks like one of my pards got to your ray cannon power supply, Hex. And now it's your turn. That's what you think, Brain Star. Yeah! The ship's still mine, Marshal, and I've got the ambassador on board. Hex is taking the ship. <laughs> Soon as I get this ship back to the hexagon, I can fix her up and attack again. I've got just one chance to stop him. And I better be ready. Now, strength of the bear! What? This has definitely not been my day. Brave Star! <laughs> Help! <sighs> oh, thanks, Brave Star. You saved my life. No thanks required. You saved our lives when you pulled the plug on tex -X's power supply. Well, the Thistledown's been repaired, Mr. Ambassador. We apologize for the delay in your travel. But I hope you can see why we need Bravestar on this planet. I do now. In fact, my adventure here on New Texas has taught me a valuable lesson about thinking before I act. I was foolish and very wrong to decide so quickly and with so little evidence that you didn't need a marshal. Well, we sure do. Yes, and no matter what I said before, Brave Star's the right man for the job. You know, it takes a lot of courage to admit making a mistake. I admire you for that, Mr. Ambassador. And if you're ever in this quadrant of the galaxy again, drop by and see us. <clears throat> you hear? No thanks, I've had enough excitement for one star year. <laughs> I'm going to go back to my nice, quiet, boring planetary coast. Goodbye! Gee, good thing he didn't come by during one of our busy days, huh? <laughs> Today's story was about teamwork. Teamwork means many people working together to get something done. Teamwork is important because often the job that needs to be done is too big or too dangerous for one person to do alone. Recapturing the carrium freighter was a big job and a dangerous one. But because everyone worked together, we managed to do it. That's teamwork. Try it next time you and your friends have a big job to do. You might be surprised at how well it works.